tele kwa kufika kwenu hapa ila ya nuku nuku na hatuna wazi wazi tunawakaribisha tuna furaha tele kwa kufika kwenu hapa ila ya nuku nuku na hatuna wazi wazi tunawakaribisha karibu Ujitetee tunaamua kesi zote bila kupendelea Tamadala za kesi twapendekeza kuhakikisha kesi digitali na lengo letu Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So the importance of the small claims court, uh, court system must uh, not be undervalued. Even though we mentioned the very small numbers of 110, that is just because we have just started. In the places where they have been doing this, I'm sure the numbers will be high. And you can see that this is 110 of people who really need justice. People who are at the place where the, we say the rubber meets the road. Because it is a claim from one shilling to a million bob, where that is where the majority of our people are. So for those others who can afford lawyers and who can afford even to wait and earn interest on their money, uh, that may not matter much. But for a person who has his 10,000, 15,000, 20,000 unpaid uh, contractual, the small claims court makes very, very, very uh, uh, much sense on almost a life or death situation. So the court goes and meets the community because we think by this method the community will learn to trust us. Love is learned, they will see our love and they will be able to say that they have confidence in the court. And if you have public confidence in the court, then our numbers at the small claims court will go up, people will be able to come uh, to court rather than uh, Temera. Eh? Yeah, you are, you are, you are the one, you know, cut that person for me before he gets away. So, other than that, now because they have confidence in the court, they will be coming here and then we will help uh, resolve. I'm delighted that the courts will provide an avenue for swift resolution of disputes between parties involving small amounts of money, and it's a great step towards making justice accessible to the male residents regardless of their social economic status. On our Chief Justice, this is a momentous occasion, paramount to enhancing access to justice and ends a historical step in our justice system. On our Chief, Chief Justice, we sit with you in the National Council of Administration of Justice and I've seen the reforms that you, you, you've moved since you became the Chief Justice of Kenya. Uh, just last week, Chief Justice, we were trying to look at the um, sentencing policy for us to be able to ensure that as the magistrates and the judges go into sentencing, then they are able to apply a guideline, which is just a guideline, but allows the magistrates and judges to still exercise their discretion. Honorable Chief Justice, um, one of the things that we partnered with uh, the judiciary and the office of the ombudsman is on alternative dispute resolution. And when you came to office, uh, Chief Justice, in our first meeting, one of the things we discussed was on how then we as the, the promoters of alternative dispute resolution are due the judiciary uh, as 
partners in looking at access to justice can then work together to ensure that uh, we deliver service to their people. Your Ladyship, uh, we also request for an extra number of judges in the Court of Appeal. You can imagine uh, serving about seven counties in Nyeri. We only have three judges. So we request that you consider uh, these other regions as well because they sit uh, in circuits. So you can imagine seven counties being served by uh, three judges, uh, your leadership. And right now they are dealing with 2016 to 2018 matters. And their appeals are being filed uh, on a daily basis uh, in the Court of Appeal. We request at least an extra three so that they are able to organize themselves better to serve us as members. Our dear uh, beautiful girl from our sons, partner with our county government to operationalize the Meru Municipal Courts. We are very ready as a county government. Our Lady Chief Justice, we are in the final process of acquiring land for construction of Timao Law Courts, and we shall soon invite you to lay the foundation uh, once the process is complete. Karibu sana in advance. Uh, the county government of Nairobi is also in the process of identifying suitable location for establishment of additional courts in Mutuate, uh, Raito, and the Mekindori. And any other place that you may wish, it is a matter of where and when we are ready as county government of Nairobi. Any business, any progress, minus marketing, it is like winking to a beautiful girl in darkness. So we are, with us, we have good news. But now we are winking to a beautiful girl in darkness. I am not aware if the judiciary have a department for marketing like other institutions. If we have one for marketing, this is the high time now we translate this document and the questions in Kimeru and then push the advert to our local Kimeru stations so that the people will understand. There are a lot of questions here which are very and equally very important. How do I institute a claim at the small court? Even myself, I don't know. I can only see Julie. Do you pay any fee for commercial cases filed at the small? I can only see Julie at least to give us this booklet in the way we can understand. That is Kimeru. And if the, the institution in Kanakomba in Mesota Kidogo in Sikusukuma, I personally volunteer to do it in Kimeru, provided you give me the advert translated so that I don't do what is wrong or what is not here. We will continuously map out the hotspots. One of the biggest problems we have here is sexual gender based violence. I cannot go away without mentioning that uh, because I don't know where we have gone wrong. I've always known the male people to be very respectful of one another. Lakini Shaitani ametuingia. So this. Uh, reputation we have garnered that we are people of Untemera will have to come to an end. We are people of love. We are people of respect. We agreed with the judges that uh, we will start a registry, a high court registry, uh, both high court registry and ELC registry, so that we start a judge circuiting in Maua. So Maua will also be a high court expression uh, very, very soon. And all these pieces of land we have been given, you've had, we have one in uh, Timau. I can't wait to come and launch the court in Timau. Uh, for the small claims court that you need uh, more adjudicators, I'm also happy to announce here that the Judicial Service Commission already uh, passed a resolution to recruit 60 more uh, resident magistrates so that we can have more adjudicators. So by May, um, Honorable Maina will have a colleague. We will operationalize a small claims court in Kobo. We will also operationalize a small claims court in Maua. If we aim to do that by June, 
uh, then we can talk of making some progress. But I also have a report on my desk that has mapped out Meru as one of the hotspots for sexual gender-based violence. And the request is that uh, we also start a specialized court here to deal with sexual gender-based violence. So those are things I can see happening between now and June. This, we call it financial year. So we are going to do a lot of work with you to sensitize people about the alternative justice system. Traditionally, we recognize that we solved our own problems. And Mero, I think, distinguished itself by having a forum during Cheke, which is being understood by the other. I think they are working on their systems and structures so that they can comply with the Constitution. And I'm very, very happy to be associated with the Meru because we have our own systems and structures of solving disputes.